Frank Stamps. Looking good, homeboy. I always thought you were handsome. And that's coming from a very straight guy that probably hated your guts. First time I saw you, just based on that. And then that little incident in the shower. You know, I leave to piss. You take it. Soaping up. Looking at me like this. You know? <laughs> and I'm like, uh, what I say, Frank? That's cool, homie. You know what? Uh, I don't fight naked in the shower. You know what I'm saying? If you want to keep it, okay? Uh, last thing I said was, we can go behind the ACC anytime you want to. Handle this, okay? Right the fuck here. I mean, I don't want to get suspended, kicked out the team for, what, making the greatest stop in the history of defensive football at Notre Dame? Uh, tell you what, Frank, you benefited at my expense. It could have been someone else. Okay, I think everybody in that team owes me to at least pay Stevie a forward, seeing as, you know what, I'm a fucking real close facsimile homeboy to this kid running. Oh, yeah, actually, when I get spun on Stevie and Wee, Frank, I'm faster than him for single sprints, okay? Um, well, how fast was I? I don't think I ever really got time. I got time 4, 6, 7, 40, but I was accelerating, okay, when other guys were topped out. And uh, I was catching Tim Brown, covering black guys, man for man, all over the field. Where were you if Holtz doesn't steal my position? Shut right up, okay? Uh, how about this? The greatest defense in Notre Dame history, Frank Stans, and because of your past performance and approach, all right? Um, yeah, you would be a middle linebacker. Marty Lippincott at nose tackle. Dan Quinn at drop-in, because you couldn't play it. Okay, Cedric Figro at rush end. Oh, he was a motherfucking monster. Okay, and then take one of the inside linebacker spots, Frank. We're the most dominant fucking defensive football team in the history of the game. Straight up. We have two first rounders on the outside that can, what, cover and sack the quarterback. Um, I could do it man for man, Figs. Could you? Okay, once you speak up, night nigga. Okay, uh, we were friends. And you know what? I got along with black guys pretty much more than I did white, you know, uh, for some reason. <laughs> Frank, uh, you and your clan. Um, it's like this. Yeah, help a brother, okay, from the same color, right? Um, whether it's different, who gives a fuck? But, yeah, pay Stevie forward. Maybe play the violin. Help this thing take off. And uh, you know what? Yeah, did I fucking, yeah, go like this? You know? Oh, maybe I gotta take this off. But I don't know what you think, friend. Do I look like a fucking 49 year old from the fucking back? You know what I'm saying? Uh, got little Ripley's. Got a little bit right here. It's not perfect. You know what? But it sure is only 272. And I still got the whole summer. You know what I'm saying? Uh, and I can stop eating like a pig. I guess if I choose. But I love eating spreads. Oh, fattening. But lots of stevia. Doesn't really matter. And it's like this, friend. Um, either help me or prove you don't like me. Get somebody that's really motherfucking fast, homeboy. Really fast, okay? And what I'll do is I'll get spun on Stevie and Weed, and I go on that hydro massage bed for like an hour, and I'll come out, and I will fucking <laughs> run step for step, okay? All down the field, probably beat him, okay? And uh, people are like, oh, my God, you know what? If you can do it for him at 49, what could it do for me at the same age or even younger? Okay? It's a pay it forward um, to Stevia blending all the toxic shit out of planet Earth's water that the rich are trying to definitely, they're not trying to save it. They're trying to kill it, homie. Okay? And you know what? They're backed up by the Catholic Church. Oh my goodness, Dr. Evil. And I'm looking for an attorney that doesn't like Dana White, hates his guts. Don't have to say that. Uh, Dan Quinn versus Dana White, TMZ, etc. all in a civil court. It's a slam fucking dunk, okay? They tried to get me killed. I woke up, went outside, and there was 14 fucking SWAT officers there to get me for supposedly making a bullshit call that I never did. Oh, yeah. All right. Thanks a lot, Dana. That plus keeping Diego Sanchez fucking silent, you know, and a lot of other things. It's going to get me paid. Okay. Um, yeah, I would never hurt you, Dana. You make me look too fucking good, both physically 
and spiritually. <laughs> I'll tell you what. Um, before you pay the women that you're with, I bet you they have somebody violin them, okay, so they can endure it. <laughs> 